Prince William set up Earthshot in 2020. And the idea of this was really about an inspirational project that was all about charity. It's a non-profit making company. So everything that they make literally goes back out to the good and the great who are instrumental in making it a success. As we saw with the charitable events of Harry and Meghan, they literally give one hour per week, both of them. So consequently, I don't think they're in any position to attack anything that William and Catherine are doing for their charitable endeavours. What's nice to know now is truly this, Prince William is taking it up, quite simply, a notch, a far bigger notch than Harry and Meghan had ever anticipated. As ever, let me explain. Hi, good morning. Neil Sean here. Let's have a wave today. You all right? Are you all right? Yes. I'm all right. Yeah, yeah, not bad. Well, coming again towards the end of another. Where's this week gone? I know. Where has this week gone? I know. I'm glad you feel like me, you see. And thank you also for your lovely comments about the recent uh, stories about supermarkets and, uh, you know, the sticking when they reduce the stuff and they don't change the barcode. Not alone in that, but truly, truly, truly be careful when you're out. I'm seeing that more and more. You know, when it's like, say, got 50 pence on the front and they've still got it down as the previous even. And you're thinking, goodness, you're really ripping shoppers off. You've got to have all your faculties about you when you're out shopping now, haven't you? Absolutely. Back as ever to your breaking roll story of the day. Now, this is an exciting story. If you are a fan of Prince William and Catherine, the Prince and Princess of Wales, William and Catherine have done a deal with the streaming giant YouTube. You're in good company, sir. Thank you so much for joining us. But this is an even bigger deal, quite frankly, than Netflix. As we know, Netflix is truly bombing right now. The subscribers are dropping out and uh, it's too expensive. I think in the cost of living crisis, people are thinking, no, that has to go. It's a luxury. It's not needed. Of course, this was the deal that Meghan and Harry managed to procure just before everything went wrong. Uh, but they got all of their money. Well, not all of it, but a good slice of their money in advance. Interesting times they were. But now you see Prince William and Catherine believe that YouTube is the way and this is going to be the incentive for people to make mini documentaries, uh, put shorts up there, mini films, you know, just little sort of info programs all about Earthshot. In fact, I've been told that the Earthshot Awards could also be streamed live via YouTube when once again it emerges later this year. And it's the way forward, it's the way that we watch television. And for television now to compete, as Prince Williams pointed out, is a totally different landscape. We also told you recently, didn't we, about the ongoing battle for the Princess of Wales and the beleaguered channel ITV and her Carols at Christmas um, incentive. Very, very popular, big ratings hit for the channel. According to a very good source, ITV better get their act together because Prince William truly believes that this could be the new home for Carols at Christmas also on YouTube. If you're a fan, as I say, of William and Catherine and you want to get involved in their Earthshot Awards, do give it a check out on their website because you too could have your work featured quite literally on the Royal YouTube channel, especially for Earthshot. Now, how exciting truly would that be? Neil Sean in the very heart of London.